Welcome back to session nine of the Virtual Escape Back class. In this session, we'll be covering sleep and relaxation. So what do you do when you feel stressed? Do you have any ways in which you help to relax? You may have heard of techniques such as mindfulness or relaxation, visualization, breathing exercises. All these techniques can be really useful for some people. However, there is no right way of doing this. There may be certain activities that you do which are specific to you and help you relax, such as calling a friend or spending time with your family. Let's have a go at some guided visualization. Make sure you are sitting comfortably. Begin to relax and close your eyes. Become aware of tension you may have in your forehead and around your eyes. Imagine this tension now melting away. Becoming aware of your jaw and the tension we hold here. Tense the jaw and then let it relax. Again, visualize the tension slowly melting away. As we move down the body, now becoming aware of the neck and the shoulders. Again, tense this area and then relax it. Visualize all the tension from your neck and shoulders slowly melting away. Visualize it melting all the way down your arms and leaving the body via the fingers. So all that tension from your head, jaw, neck and shoulders is now relaxed. Now we're going to escape Keeping your eyes closed, now visualize you are on a warm beach. You are supported on a soft, cushioned bed. Become aware of the sea. In the distance, you can hear the waves coming in and going out again. Breathing in and breathing out like the waves come onto the shore. Breathing in and then breathing out. You can feel the warm sun on your face and your skin. 
feel the sun coming down. onto your skin and feel that nice warming sensation there's not a cloud in the sky you can see the white fastness of the beach you have no worries here it's quiet and peaceful. Again, breathing in and breathing out as you hear the sea move in and as it moves out. Feeling the sun on your face and the comfort of the padded bed. Stay here for a few moments. The blue sky. The moving waves. And the sun on your face. Take this time to relax your body. Again, take a deep, deep breath in. And then breathing out. Slowly, we're going to return to your normal life. What I would now like you to do is move your toes, wiggle your fingers, and as you feel ready, slowly open your eyes. Familiarise yourself with the room around you and hopefully you can take this element of calm and relaxation into the rest of your day. We have attached some links that may help you with mindfulness or relaxation. There are also DVDs, audiobooks, YouTube channels. Everybody relaxes in a different way. So find what works for you. Thank you. So let's talk about sleep. Poor sleep can contribute to the persistence of pain. It's important to have a good routine with your sleep and to perform certain things that are good for sleep hygiene, such as limiting the amount of blue light before dusk, no caffeine approximately seven hours before bed, cooling your room before you go to sleep, maybe having a hot bath or doing something relaxing before you go to bed, exercising, but not exercising three hours before you go to sleep. Thank you for watching session nine. Join us again for session 10, where we'll be covering managing flare-ups.